At Implantodent, you can truly treat periodontal disease. Periodontal disease, commonly known as periodontitis, is translated as damage of teeth, supportive tissue, meaning foundation, represented by maxillary bone and gum. It represents the most frequent cause of natural teeth and dental implant loss. The first stage of periodontal disease is called gingivitis, a condition being limited only to the gum, which due to inflammation, takes on a scarlet red aspect and at some point it starts to bleed, provoked or unprovoked. Even if commercials call on you to use certain toothpaste when your gums are bleeding, we advise you to consult a specialist at once. A professional cleaning, properly conducted and correct brushing training from a specialist can lead to healing. Toothpastes, teas and other remedies do not heal periodontal disease. They are only an adjuvant in the supportive treatment, followed only after the professional cleaning. Periodontal disease evolves without obvious signs for the patient, often being discovered too late and is nicknamed beautiful teeth disease. After it passes the gingival stage, breath becomes malodorous, starts to smell unpleasant, and gums start to bleed during brushing and in contact with food, and even pus could develop at the teeth base. With the disease evolution, infection will reach supportive bone and starts its progressive destruction until it will have been eroded in an increased proportion and teeth will begin to move. One thing is for certain, untreated periodontal disease leads to teeth loss. As a consequence, it harms aesthetics as well as the dental maxillary system, or briefly, the quality of life. Simultaneously, Gum and bone infection can seriously affect the whole body, being involved in diabetes, cardiovascular, neurological, pulmonary, digestive and even pregnancy and birth complications. Retracted gums with parts of the root exposed can be a sign of an advanced stage of periodontal disease. Still, we have to consider the fact that gums never retract on their own. They only follow bone and remain in place on it. The more retracted the gum, the more bone is resorbed. Unfortunately, bone resorption is not visible to the eye and can only be diagnosed through dental tomography, tridimensional or periodontal probing. It is good to know that periodontal disease has one determined factor, the microbial one, and there are a series of favoring factors among which are genetic predisposition, smoking, unbalanced bite and many others. It equally affects natural teeth, called periodontal disease or periodontitis, as well as dental implants, being named perimplantitis. Dental implants are not inserted inside the oral cavity with active infections, including the periodontal natural ones. First, we treat the disease, after which we make additions or insert dental implants. It is also good to know that periodontal disease has an autoimmune type of mechanism, pathogen bacteria invasion which are accumulating and developing inside the bacterial plaque and dental tartar determine a defense reaction from the body followed by substance secretion in the gingival crevice to annihilate bacteria. Unfortunately, besides bacteria, the substances also destroy collagen, a component found in significant amounts inside the bone, periodontal fibers and gums, thereby Gums as well as bones are indirectly affected yet difficult to treat. At Implantodent, you will find highly specialized professionals familiarized with advanced treatment protocols, as well as the most modern equipment necessary for an effective treatment of periodontal disease. Facility equipment allows us to perform complex and complete investigations to offer the clinician all the necessary information in order to diagnose and properly treat periodontal disease with minimal invasiveness. Advanced laser systems successfully replace scalpels and sutures such that even the most fearful patients can have their periodontal disorders treated in maximum safety and comfort. Therefore, from the beginning, Information provided by dental tomography and classical periodontal and digital probing will offer a precise image for each tooth regarding disease stage. This, combined with data provided by a PET test, 
which is an in vitro diagnosis test for pathogenic agents involved in the emergence and development of periodontitis and periimplantitis, will open the way for the advanced treatment of periodontal disease. The purpose for periodontal treatment is to remove pathogenic microbes from gingival and bone pouches in teeth to allow guided regeneration of damaged tissues. In our clinics, treatment has a non-invasive character or, at most, minimally invasive. Thanks to the combined work with classic tools like curettes, ultrasound-activated heads and with the latest generation of laser devices, since the dentistry market is loaded with all sorts of cheap and questionable devices that emit light and use lasers with no result, we feel obliged and proud at the same time to emphasize that implantodense laser technology is the most efficient for dental treatments, especially periodontal. Its seven laser units operating with the most effective wavelengths in fighting periodontal disease are the most effective treatments available. With no amount of irony, we advise patients to be careful when reading marketing messages that oversaturate the internet and to remember that a so-called underperforming laser can be purchased for a few hundred euros and brings no therapeutic benefits while an advanced laser, developed by dedicated companies, can cost between 50 and 80,000 euros. To identify micro details and to ensure that all damaged tissues are properly and totally removed, our clinical staff perform significant stages of treatment, assisted by magnifier lenses and high-performance microscopes, which can identify what the human eye can't normally see. Ultrasound technology can identify subgingival deposits of tartar and bacterial plaque, activating the heads only when discovered to not needlessly traumatize healthy tissue. Being a microbial-determined disease, the most effective way of prevention remains proper oral hygiene for total removal, over time, of bacterial plaque and tartar in which those pathogen microbes accumulate. Correct oral hygiene translates to one performed at home, but trained by a professional dental technician and with regularly and professionally performed examinations and treatments inside a clinic. Depending on the disease predisposition, pre-existent treatments and smoking Regular professional cleaning should be performed every three to six months. Let's not forget that prophylactic treatments are cheaper than treatments which require replacement of compromised or lost teeth. In the end, please keep in mind that periodontal disease is efficiently treated only when you yourselves are motivated enough to keep your teeth. Treatment loses efficiency and results can be cancelled when oral hygiene and regular visits to the dentist are neglected. It cannot be cured at home, neither with toothpaste nor with creams or miracle solutions, but only with guidance and careful monitoring from specialists which possess knowledge, expertise and necessary equipment. At Implantodent, you can truly treat periodontal disease.